Hi, my name is Spencer, and today I'll be reacting to Obi-Wan Kenobi, Episode 5. Uh, I'm excited to get into this. I've liked the show so far. It's just, it's been an, a good ride so far with uh, Ewan McGregor as Obi-Wan. It's hard not to enjoy him as Obi-Wan. And then, uh, we've only gotten, like, little bits of Anakin um, with Hayden Christensen, so... Uh, could do a little more of that, that'd be nice, but... Yeah, I mean, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying little Leia. Uh, she's a lot more involved than I thought she would be when we first met her. Or even before the show, we didn't even know she was going to be in the show. And it was like, oh, she's in the show. Okay, cool. Uh, and it's just been this trying to get her back home. But people keep getting in the way. The darn Inquisitors keep coming, coming back. So yeah. Uh, last episode we had, well, they rescued Leia again from the Inquisitor's Fortress. And they, uh, well, they got her out. Uh, Obi-Wan discovered a Jedi tomb in sort of the basement of the, the fortress. We lost Wade, uh, one of the uh, people, I want to say rebels, but maybe I'm using that term incorrectly, maybe. Anyways, we lost Wade, uh, they got away, but Reva placed a tracker, which is just Lola. She like put a tracker on Lola or something, or reprogrammed Lola or something. I don't know what that entailed, but Lola is a tracker, they are being tracked. So, yeah, I don't know. Ideally, <laughs> they would just drop off Leia with Lola, and then they'd end up just tracking Leia at Alderaan, and then Obi-Wan would be back at Tatooine, and then they wouldn't have to, like, then they'd be like, oh, well, <laughs> so much for this tracker idea, and then Reva would die, because she failed, and yeah, but, uh... It's probably not going to go that way. They'll probably extend this whole Obi-Wan and Leia situation for as long as possible. I'm curious about where this show is going to end. There's only two episodes left, including this one. So after this one, there's only one left, as far as we know. And I'm not sure how this is going to end. Are we going to get like another face-off between Vader and Obi-Wan? Uh, now that Obi-Wan is sort of brushed off the cobwebs of the force uh, and his lightsaber and he'll be better prepared to face Anakin maybe yeah I don't know I mean we'll see where this goes um, I'm hoping this episode is fun I'm hoping it's interesting and engaging uh, I hope it's not just I hope it doesn't feel like they're just trying to stretch the storyline as long as they can but we'll see uh, <laughs> um, don't forget to like this video if you like it and if you have anything to say about it or the previous episodes put it in the comments i appreciate your interaction i like your thoughts i like to well i like when you guys answer any questions i have about things that i may not be so knowledgeable about in the star wars universe uh, so if there's anything in this episode that i question or have questions about, then please uh, educate me. I don't, yeah, I'm not not as familiar with Star Wars as some people might be, but I'm here, and I'm here to enjoy this show, so thank you for, thank you for being here. Um, if you aren't currently subscribed, I would ask that you would consider it. Uh, I'm just over 100 subscribers now, which is pretty exciting. So, thank you to all, thanks to all of you who have already subscribed, uh, and I'm looking forward to producing more of this content for you guys. So, without further ado, I think I will go ahead and get this episode started. Where he goes, it will follow. Unless he drops her off, like he's supposed to.
Is this a flashback? Oh, there you are. Yeah. Nice. I was beginning to think you weren't coming. Let's go. Are you ready? Are you? I mean, you can tell Hayden's older, but it's okay. I'm cool with it. Grand Inquisitor. Probably won't last long, but we'll see. Set a course, Captain. We leave for Jabim at once. I wonder if we'll get flashbacks throughout the episode. That'd be nice. Everyone but Wade. We got her. Also, I did recognize this Asian Asian, Asian actress. Uh, she's in. She's from uh, Pen Fifteen or whatever. It's not easy. This place is a good business opportunity, though. Hmm. Of course. I'm out with the windows closing. We held it to help you get the kid. We only have a few hours. Well, lucky for you, the, the Empire's coming right after you, so that that should totally go well with your plans. Some lightsabers. I wouldn't be able to recognize lightsabers. Any one specific lightsaber. The Imperial destroyer just arrived in orbit above us. She must have tracked us. It's not her, it's Vader. She wants us to surrender. She wants you to surrender. Be mindful. A Jedi's goal is to defend life, not take it. <laughs> Mercy doesn't defeat an enemy, Master. Gee, <laughs> why you're gonna lose? <laughs> Love the flashbacks. Launch the attack. It's probably just going to be the one flashback played over and over, well, from different different parts of the same flashback. Like we won't get any other context or anything. I know some people hope for like Clone Wars flashbacks, but I don't think it'll happen. Well, she got what she wanted. I don't know if... I doubt it will last very long. At least not... Not to the very end of the series, for sure. <laughs> you trust me? I trust her. Get her the ladder. Get her a ladder. Quick! I will say, in, in the flashbacks, they did make Obi-Wan look pretty young. Like, younger than he does here. Either that or they made him look older for this. For the future scenes. Is everything alright? It will be. Just gotta get her home. We're in trouble. Okay. Oh. They're almost reaching the door. I'll buy as much time as I can. I mean, even if they just want you, they're not going to let these people go. But maybe she will let her ego get in the way. Wouldn't that be nice for, for the good guys? You mean Anakin? You knew who Vader was. Back on Dayu, how did you not 
Yeah. Lots of people were wondering this. It doesn't matter where I was. The night of Order 66, you were a young lady. That's how you knew. You saw him. Stop. Anakin killed the others. That's enough. He killed the other young ladies, Enough. But somehow you enough! It's getting into your head. what people theorized as. They were the only family I knew. And he's lost. That was a nice breakthrough, but it seems too simple. You are hunting him. Let me help you. Why would I ever trust you? Because we want the same thing. Do we, Obi? Do you really want Anakin dead? Hmm. Anyone. You won't stop him alone. You have no idea what I've done alone. Well, that would have been easy from the start. Just to cut through the the thing. I mean, at least we know what her true intentions are now. That she's actually against Vader. She's doing it a different way than the Jedi would. Are you listening to me? I feel like you're not listening to me. Would you stop talking? He said it was a red breaker. Red. I know what he said. Go, go, go. Go. She gonna find Lola? I have, like, no emotional attachment to this droid. So, there's no... There's no concern for his well-being. Eh, I don't really have much emotional attachment to her, either. Honestly. Like, sure, it's sad that she's dying, but... I wasn't, like, super attached to her character. Nice. We love a good sacrifice. I feel bad for Obi-Wan, uh, because he cared about her, but... Seize him. Okay. Interesting. I mean, Lola could play stupid, change the color back to white, and then play dead. I don't know. You won't see it coming. Because all you'll see is me. We can take a guess at how this is going to end because we know where it ends up. Like I want to root for them, but it's over. Your need for victory, Anakin, it blinds you. I really like seeing Hayden, Christ Hayden Christ Christensen back. It's nice. Where is he? I have him secured inside, my lord. I will bring him in myself. What? What is the plan here? Oh, well, that was easy. Such a simple little bug to take off. Nice. 
No guarantees you'll be able to get out, but. Oh, well done. Where's Hala? She didn't make it. Oh, dang. He says, I'm not letting you go that easy. Sheesh. Okay, it was just a decoy. I mean, I don't know how they managed to fool him like that, but... How is she gonna... She's gonna die. Yeah. You should have, like, pointed it at him and then turned it on. And then it would have just gone right through him. He says, fight me, like, for real now. Can't play dead this time. I feel worse for her than I did for Tala. <laughs> did you really believe I did not see it, youngling? Yep. You are up no further. And the Grand Inquisitor is alive, yep. Now it is tiresome. He says this belongs to me. Goodbye, Grand Inquisitor. So they're just leaving her, okay. Not even gonna finish the job. I mean, she'll probably die, but there's always the chance that she could survive. What are you gonna do now? Are you gonna kill yourself? I mean, I'd put myself out of my misery, honestly. Communicator that he dropped. That Kumail dropped. You're listening. Something's wrong. Oh, is she gonna find out about? She's gonna see the message. What's she gonna do with that information? It's like, obviously, she's not gonna get into oh, Vader's good graces again. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Uh, I, was, I liked it. I liked the episode. Uh, liked all the flashbacks. I mean,. It was really just one flashback that they cut up into bits. But it was nice to see them uh, young and, yeah, friends still. Um, I mean, we also saw Anakin uh, in a flashback killing the younglings. So uh, there was that too. But, yeah. I'm not, I'm not quite sure where this is going to go from here. Because we have... Like, what is Reva gonna do with that information? Cause she obviously, obviously she can't take it to Vader, cause... Well, cause obviously she's... She's not with them anymore. And... Even if she was, like... Vader knows nothing of his children. When... A New Hope happens. 
So, unless he does. I don't... I cannot recall where Vader gets the information that Luke is his son. It's been forever since I've seen the, the old movies, so... Maybe that does happen here. I... I... But I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure he didn't know before A New Hope. Or he, like, he didn't have any idea that his children were still alive. Or that his children even exist. Anyways. Yeah. A lot of people predicted the Reva thing. N not her necessarily being after or being against Vader. But her being one of the younglings. Then yeah, yeah, they... That was predicted quite easily by a lot of people. I don't know if I would have predicted that had I not seen other people's predictions, but only one episode left. I'm not sure where what, where this is going to go from here. Kenobi has to drop off Leia. He's probably going to have to deal with this Reva situation, her knowing something about Luke um, and his uncle, whose name escapes me right now. So, yeah, that's... They've got to deal with that. Um, I'm not sure if we'll get much more Vader in this. It kind of seems like we're done with him, unless we're going to have, like, a scene or something where... Or, or we're going to... Maybe we'll keep going with this uh, him hunting uh, Obi-Wan... Yeah, I don't... I don't think I have anything else to say. Oh, wait. I did think it was kind of silly that it was super easy for uh, Leia to fix Lola. <laughs> like, you would think it would have been a little more convoluted than just taking off a little thing. But what do I know? And, yeah. I wasn't that invested in Tala or that droid, so... Their deaths didn't really affect me much. I mean, I thought it was nice that she sacrificed herself to give them a chance. So, good good, good on her for that. I mean, she was good, probably going to die anyways. So, yeah, I think that's all I have to say. So, let me know what you guys thought in the comments. I appreciate hearing what you guys think. If there was anything that I misinterpreted, please correct me. I look forward to the next episode, to the last episode. It should be the last episode. Are you guys looking forward to it as well? Uh, anyways, thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. I uh, appreciate all the support that you guys give me. And, yeah. I think I will see you guys next time.